Thank you, Jason. Thank you. Good job. I guess if you press things enough times, it, it works. <laughs> and so, so um, you, you saw S.H.I.E.L.D. Um, enjoy games from two of the most important digital stores in the world, the Google App Store, Play Store, within it, a curated game store called TegraZone. Everything you buy there on your phone, on your tablet, from your PC, using their website, just shows up on Shield. You download it, and you play it the way it's meant to be played. You could also connect to the other great store, Steam, with almost 2,000 games, with 50 mil 54 million gamers. All of these gamers are now able to enjoy their Steam games from anywhere around the house, and hopefully in the future, even beyond that. And our vision is that, that the way you play games with these devices, because you have a screen here now, and the controller and the computer, the processors are right there inside the controller, the, the type of games we'll be able to enable will be very different. Imagine each one of your shields, you see the driver's cock cockpit view. However, everybody who's inside, who's wa they're watching you, aren't looking at the cockpit pit view or a split screen view, but they're looking at a spectator view. You can imagine all kinds of different ways now to create games as a result of this kind of model. And so just to summarize what, hap what we talked about today, the consumer electronics industry has been radically, radically changed over the last 10 years. The PCs connect to mobile devices, and these digital devices, the digital devices have cloud services that provides for music and music and, and movies and books, and all of these devices can stream to multiple devices now and multiple screens. We wanted to, over the last five years, create the pieces necessary for us to do the same for video games. And so today, to summarize the things that you've seen today, this is what we've done. We created GFE, which is essentially an application that allows the end user to enjoy the game simply, but to take advantage of their full potential of their personal computer. It makes video games simple like a game console on a PC. There's a piece of software that's inside this GFE that also streams and connects it to a mobile device. This mobile device is called Shield. Now you can enjoy your PC games processed on GeForce GTX streamed to your device anywhere in the house. This shield also allows you to today connect what we showed you was HDMI, but in a very short period of time, we'll also be able to connect wirelessly, just like AirPlay, using the same technology that we showed you today using streaming technology to stream it to your television as well. And so you should be able to sit on your, on your, um, on your couch and uh, if you decide that you would like to share the movie that you're watching on your shield on television, you simply have to beam it to your television. The television needs a, needs a receiver. It could be a smart television. It could be a uh, Oya game console uh, that they're working on. It could be a little dongle that is Wi-Fi to HDMI. All of these experiences are then supplemented uh, with a cloud service made possible by Grid. Cloud services will come to us in a lot of different channels and a lot of different formats, just as cloud services today for music and, and TV shows and otherwise. And together, it creates the ability for us to enjoy video games on any device, at any time, at any place, and on any screen. These elements of technology has taken us quite a while to put together, and it looks like we have a little bit more work on Shield. And, um, uh, but I think it's going to usher in the same type of experiences that we were able to enjoy for music and movies over the cloud and in this untethered way, but now, finally, for video games. I want to thank all of you for coming today. Um, hope you stay around and enjoy the party with us. Thank you, everybody. Happy New Year.